Greetings and salutations, this is Imperator Vespasian and his trusty sidekick. Hello. Today we're bringing you... Corn Blood Throne. Awesome. Yeah. I bought this for him and he didn't know. Right? I got it for him and I said, he's, he's gonna love this. He's gonna absolutely love this. And I picked it for him and I, I looked through all the different stuff that Corn does and I said, you know what, this is going to be what he wants. This is going to be awesome. And I got him some um, um, uh, psychers as well, because he wanted some psychers. And I got him the psychers. He was very happy with the psychers. And then I got him this box. And I said, look what I've got for you. <laughs> you tell the story from that. <laughs> and then I, I decided to point out the fact that in the stat collecting box, this is in it. Oh, it's brilliant, it's brilliant. Yeah, just not... Yeah, so, I'm just wasting my time there, so... You should have got me my god. <sighs> well, we're going to deal with gods later. We said we'll deal with gods later. Take it away. You'll pack it for me. Oh my god. I'm doing this now, <laughs> Yes, you're doing this. <laughs> what even is this? Right, this is the base. <laughs> this is the base. Okay, so this is the base of it. It's huge. Um, this is the cannon. Right, that's the cannon. This is the cannon. Right. This is the area where the um, blood letters stand. And then you get... That's a big base. Well, that... Um, you can make either one. Oh. Now, given that you're wanting the start collecting box, and you get this in it, you could make one of them, and then make a different one with the start collecting box. What do you think? Then you could have the one with the cannon, and the one with the, ch the chariot version. That seems like a good idea. Yeah. So, was it as bad as a uh, buy as you thought? No. No? At least I had two now. Yeah, yeah. But one of them I can adapt into a proper chariot. Yeah. And the other one could be a cannon. Yeah. That's going to be pretty good. So, yeah, that, that does look complicated. slightly complicated. Not as bad as the um, Primaris tank. The Primaris tank is. Uh, looks like it's going to give me a migraine. Yeah. Someone's hair in this, man. It's not hair. It's plastic. That is really, really thin it's, plastic. It's, no, it's, it's, as it, it's been taken out of the mould when it's still slightly hot, and the plastic's just stretched as they took it out of the mould. Oh. You sometimes get a hot spot. <laughs> so that's, what, that's why it does that. So what do you think of this, then? Um, you're asking me. It's very great. Right. It's very detailed. I think it's awesome. Uh, I like, um, if you, you know, if you're not using it as a chariot, it gives you two extra corn troops. So you get two additional corn troops. Uh, same with my demon chariot. If you don't use the, all the, if you use a different version, you can, you get spare, spare infantry for it. Which is actually good, considering your two corn troops down for your corn squad. Indeed. So you're actually one up in that case, aren't you? We will see what we plan to do. Yeah. So you can do it as the chariot or the gun. And this will be a chariot. Yeah. Probably a good idea. Because in the start collection set you get a can anyway. So I may as well convert that to a can, can like it's supposed to. So I'll turn this into the chariot and use that one as the can. Yeah. 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 Good idea. I like the, the, the fact that it's... In, in a way it, it's a creature. But in another way it's a machine. Because demons use... Um, that the, they're creatures that, that they can possess machines to make them work. So they made it look animalistic. With the iron plates look like scales. It looks animalistic, which means it's actually possessed by a demon that makes it work, which is spooky. Yeah, yeah, that's really cool. That's one of the cool things about the Iron Warriors. All their vehicles are, are powered by demons, but the demons are slaves. Because the Iron Warriors. Don't like demons. <laughs> they oh yeah, them. yeah. They, they trick them into going into machines somewhere. Yeah, they just use them. Yeah. Which is how chaos should be. 
follow the path of Horus. You just use the Chaos Gods. You don't serve them. Unlike Khorne, you serve the Chaos God of Khorne. Good. That's brilliant. Yeah. What's wrong with this? Oh, Slanesh, where you kind of serve the, the God of Slanesh, but Slanesh doesn't really care. When you get forced into it. Not really. It's just because your mind gets corrupted. Well, Slanesh gives you the, the choice. That's the whole point of Slanish, you know. You, you, it, it, it's your call to do what you want, and that's how come you end up t- turning to Slanish because it makes it easier. Where Zinch, well, they're, they're magic. That's all to do with the power of warp. I'm beginning to suspect that Zinch has something to do with that clock. No. No, seriously, I think it was Zinch. I no. think Zinch was the clock clockmaker. No. No. Why not? No. Well, how else do you explain it? Maybe it's a very smart clock. But in the warp, time is is not relative, right? Right? The time can be squidgy. Mm -hmm. Yeah? So, what if Zinch, because Zinch is the only god who would know, uh, Slanish, I don't don't even sure Slanish was around at the time, but Zinch would have known who the Emperor was going to be. And he knew what path humanity was on. So it would make sense that the clockmaker knew. Which is why the clock began to ring as the emperor walked away from the burning church. Because he knew the emperor has just set humanity on the path of destruction. The person who wrote that was probably really really happy himself. He probably was because he's kept people thinking ever since. Sorry, if you don't know what we're talking about, it's a book. (laughs) Don't worry about it. Uh, the last church. There's a clock, and uh, never mind. I, it's just uh, who cares? It, it doesn't, it's not important. The last priest on earth. The last priest on earth. into the burning building and dies. Yeah, he, he meets the emperor, and the emperor tries to convince him that his whole religion thing's rubbish, and he should embrace the imperial truth. And the the religious guy, the the, the, the last priest on earth, agrees with the emperor and walks out with him, and and then. The Emperor says, now we're going to, as his, as his church is burning, the Emperor says, now we're going to go and spread truth to the entire galaxy. Our fleets are ready, we're going to go out into space. And the, and the priest says... Forget. He did say that, no. Uh, the priest says, what gives you the right to decide what's true well, and what yes. isn't? And the Emperor says, because I'm right. Making him a tyrant just like all the other tyrants. And as they walk away, the clock starts to chime. And no one's got a choice. Because you, know, you can't disobey the Emperor anymore. No. But what did the clock... No, the clock was broken. The, the, the priest found the clock many, many, many years earlier. He stole it, actually. It was a broken clock. Yep, it was a broken clock. And what was the thing about the clock? He said that the uh, clock would ring when humanity is doomed. Yeah. Or it's going to die. Humanity is over. And it rang just as just as the Emperor walked away from Burn Church. Yeah. So the Emperor was beginning the crusade at that moment. And that was that signified the end of humanity. That's deep, isn't it? And I reckon that's Zinch. I reckon it's just a clock that when well, c- c- cause it was really hot in there maybe it would have made it slumped one side, which would have made it ring. You're just like the Emperor. You you are so like the Emperor, that is exactly what the Emperor would say. See, the Emperor would say, well, it's just the heat made the clock thing, and, 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 and then the broken bit worked, and then it chimed. That's all it was. There's no such thing as demons. There's no such thing as, 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 as warp entities. They're just creatures that live in the warp. They're, they're, not, they're not demons. It's fine. None of that's real. There's no, nothing true. It's just the imperial truth. That's all there is. There's no ghost in the machine that makes things work. There's no, you know, none of that stuff exists. It's just the imperial truth. And how did that get the emperor? An empire. And then the demons popped up. And it still the, has an empire. And the Primarch said... Oh look, the Emperor lied to us. He didn't lie. How's he, how's he supposed to know there's going to be demons in the warp? He knew there were demons in the warp. He'd already had arguments with them. He'd already met them. Right, so, um, Khorne, 
There we go. Yep. Put it this way, Con will never build a clock. I can't imagine a clone, a clone, clone, con warrior sat making a clock. Can you? Well, I mean, if a clock's in the hand in front of someone, then I'm sure they'll do that. It me if he, if he thinks it's a hand grenade. If he finds the clock on the floor and it's an object, a blunt object, he could use it as a weapon. Yeah, use a weapon. Yeah, yes, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe the clock has spiky bits. I mean, that's happened. The, the guy walked into the church. And a blood that was in there, you know, just investigating. But right, because it was on fire. Yeah. It, it beat the cock and beat the beat the. the, the and that was the ringing death. sound yeah. as he was beating the priest to death. Yeah, they was actually calm the whole time. Yes. Yeah, that's it. You've actually solved it. You've, 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 you've solved the problem. <laughs> Makes perfect sense. Right. Sorry, we we we've done it again, haven't we? Yes. <laughs> we wandered off again. We do that a lot. Um, if you're still watching our channel at this point, you're probably aware that we never actually stick to. What we're supposed to be doing. Um, I, I think our unboxing videos are some of the strangest you can find because we never really talk about the stuff we're unboxing. There's a fly. Yeah, and, and let's face it, it's just a lot of stuff. It's not interesting until we've built it. And then we'll talk about it then. Part two of the clock saga. Swear to God, just heard someone whisper upstairs. I just heard someone whisper as well, which is weird because we're the only two people in the house. I heard that too. <laughs> yes, that's exactly what I heard. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to turn the camera off anymore. <laughs> okay, it's okay. It's, uh, we've got we're, three, we're a ghost hunting channel now. Right, we've got three choices, right? One, corn. Right? If oh, it's corn, yeah. we're in trouble. Two, slanesh. We're really in trouble <laughs> if it's slanesh. Three, zinch. Mid will be okay. You know? We're not really sure what he's up to. Four, no. Zinch is. Yeah, Zinch is. Zinch is. is. We'll, we'll, we'll deal with that. Yeah. No, that's fine. That's fine. I don't think Zinch will be running around though going... No, I think that's, out of all of them, Zinch is probably the one most likely to do that. It's more of a slanish thing to do. Is there this sort of whisper ideas to you, don't they, slanish? Oh, come on. The arm speaks to you. What? Oh, it does. Yes. That, that... The, you're right, the armor, the armor talk, yeah, because the armor is actually possessed by a demon. So your you, you demon, hence the chains. Yeah. That's, that was the, the fact. Uh, just wait there a second. We recently did a video on this box. Um, I think we'll load this up before this video so you'll be able to see it. On this video we mentioned the chains that they wear. The reason they wear the chains is to bind the demon in the armor. That Which makes you fast and more stronger. Yes. Because it's two people. Yeah, it's actually the demon is running. You're not. You're not using your energy because that's why you can run for so long. And, and yeah, that that's basically the. <sighs> Sorry, that took a while to get there. <laughs> it took us another video to yeah, do video like before that. we remembered. That's that's that 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 that's a good a good thing. That that that's yeah. Anyway, the video's over. Yeah, the video's Go over. Go away. Yeah. <laughs> Leave. Just go watch cats or something. Watch cats? Yeah, cats. What, cats. Are like 2009 YouTube cats? Do they still do cat videos? No. No? No. Maybe some meme version of it. Okay.